What's up, Windsor Community Church? For those of you that don't know me, my name is Stephen Atherton. I'm the youth director here at WCC. There are so many new things happening and changing at WCC and a lot going on and changing with youth ministry. So I just wanted to take a minute to tell you about T11, T51, who we are, and the changes that are going to be happening within our groups. And then also introduce, last but not least, my incredible leaders that work so hard for your students. So first things first, what are we even about? in WCC Youth Ministry. I feel like a lot of times when people hear youth and youth ministry, all they think about is chairs being flung across rooms and just pure chaos with a sprinkle of Jesus in there. But that's not us at all. Do we get crazy and throw chairs and do stuff like that? Of course, because it wouldn't be youth ministry without that. But we go so much deeper. As leaders, we're people that love the Lord, we love students and we desire to see them come into a sold out relationship with Jesus. We're here to build relationships with students to share the gospel, the truths of God's word and bring them into a community where they feel loved and welcomed and accepted. The T in our T11 and T51 stands for team, which is teach, encourage, adore and model. We're ready in season and out of season to teach God's word. We're always there to encourage students in any walk of life adore and love them as Christ loves us and model a life following hard after Christ. All this so students can come to know the Lord in a personal way, grow in their knowing of Him, and go and tell others about Him. Here in WCC Youth Ministry, we, we refuse to water stuff down. This is not who we are. We're always teaching word for word through a book of the Bible. Through that, we're able to dig deep into any and all issues facing these students. The Bible is active, it's living, it's breathing, it speaks into anything and everything that may be going on in their lives and the world around them. I'm not sure most of you have seen over the last eight months or not, but youth ministry has been all over the place. It, with Zoom calls, park hangouts, programming shutting down and only events happening. But I am so excited to say that we are so, 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 so close <laughs> to having everything back to normal and off the ground. We as a ministry, we've been working tirelessly to, to rewrite, to restructure, and restart youth group better than ever before. A piece of this puzzle that's, that's going to change so much is an internship program that we got started up off the ground here recently. This program is going to bring two young adults with the heart and the desire to do youth ministry in the door, not only to help it function well, but to have the time and the capacity to be out in the world with students. With this new system in place, we'll actually be able to give each of your students the time that they need to really dig in and be there for them through the crazy times in their lives. Within that, we're going to have true, dedicated focus on small groups. In the past, we've tried a variation of small group, and, and because of the lack of time my leaders have been able to offer up with full-time jobs, full-time families, it, it was never the, done the best that they could be. Each of our leaders will have a group of students that they're going to be meeting with outside of programming time, it's gender specific, and take time to really dig deep into each other's lives and especially into God's Word. We're also going to be utilizing high school students with a heart to serve um, in our middle school program to not only teach them how to lead, but to show the younger students that look up to them what it looks like to lead for the sake of the gospel and the kingdom. When we restart, we're going to be back to our, our normal programming, which is going to be for uh, high school T51. It's gonna be Sundays from 6.30 to 8.30. And then for middle school, it's going to be Wednesdays from 6.30 to 8. Now, I wanna take the time to introduce our very first intern in our internship program, who I feel like has such a deep love for students and desire that they come to know the Lord, that she actually likes hanging out with middle schoolers. Just kidding, middle schoolers are awesome. I'm very excited to have her in the door. I think that the program is going to look so different and just the ability that we're gonna to have to reach out to your students is going to change so drastically. So without further ado, our new intern. and I'm your new friendly neighborhood youth ministry intern. The church and these students have taught me a lot, but one of the most important things is that leading in a way that represents Christ well is something that is really stuck with me. I can honestly say that working in these students' lives have been truly amazing, and I can't wait to see what Christ can do in this ministry through myself and our leadership team this school year. 
Hi, I'm Jake, and I've been a youth group leader at WCC for the past three years or so. Uh, I've really loved working with your students. It's either keeping me young or aging me prematurely, not sure which. Uh, anyhow, I look forward to this upcoming year. Hope you guys are doing well. Hey guys, it's JJ. Um, I just wanted to say that I am so thrilled for the year that we have coming. I've been doing youth ministry for about six years now almost. Um, and I mostly am just dedicated into the high school ministry. Um, I am so excited and blessed by you all. And I cannot wait for the year that we have to come. So. Hi, I'm Jake. Thank you guys for letting me be a part of this ministry. I've been helping Stephen with both youth groups for the last three years and it's been a blast. I really love getting to connect with the students and really dig deep into their lives. And I just, I'm so happy that we get to be here for them. Hi, my name is Jared. Uh, I've been a part of WCC for the last 10 years and I'm just now starting to uh, help with the youth ministry and I'm really looking forward to helping out everyone and just hoping to see these kids grow in God. Hey, I'm Jake, and I love working with your kids, but not in a creepy way. Take 465. 1,467. 1, 1,000, 4,000, 2,000, 2. Lost count of takes. Lights, camera, don't care what takes. Baby sweep, sweeps. Woof, woof, woof. Baby sweep, sweep.